And welcome back to round two for this uh, TSA for this Friday. We have, let's see here, a Anderson's counterattack. Current server pop is 269, 133 on the attacking CSA versus 136 on defending Union. And I am joined by a guest from the 19th Indiana. Hello, everybody. I'm Captain Joker, and I am currently thick as shit, which is why I'm not leading it. I'm just spectating it. Today. There we go, so now you get to just judge people from above and not have to worry about actually, you know, responsibility and all that fun stuff. Well, I will be judging my guys very heavily, so. So, so who's leading? Let's see, uh, what's, what team is 19th Indiana? They're on the Union team, They're right? They're on the Union, yes. Let's see, we could swing down to them as they're getting organized. So it's uh, Mr. Motorheart. Yeah, it looks like he's leading here. So, um, and... I was gonna ask. So I see a couple guys with this JV thing in the name. What what is the JV thing? But not all so, you guys have that. The the JV was kind of a joke between me and Pineapple Warrior because we got uh, started talking about sports and like high school basketball and stuff. Um, and so he mentioned that he was on JV at one point, and so therefore we just started making jokes about JV, and uh, he just kind of ran away with it. And so now some people like to wear JV because they think it's funny. Uh, some people think it's yeah, you know, whatever. It's it's a joke. Okay, no, I was I was just wondering. I was like, what? it's like, is there another brigade that just formed that I wasn't tracking? No. I was like, so you know, like you guys are gonna follow after night here and change like your. You know, table of organization every other week, man. I'm like, okay, who is where now? It's like, no. no, it's it's just a it's just a fun little joke that we like to play amongst ourselves. A lot of us were high school athletes, uh, especially in Indiana, being a basketball state. So, uh, who's your? Uh, okay. Oh, well, looks like we are live at 43, and it looks like the union is moving pretty far forward here. Um, I could be coy and say I wasn't at the stretch the sketch, but we both were. So, um, what, do, what, what are you tracking as far as the union plan if you were trying to try and describe it right now? So, right now, the, the usual union plan is to always go on the left side, buy some time for Artie. Um, however, it just never seems to really work anymore. So, we've never seen somebody try and form a line that is to the far right and maybe even surprise the CSA. To you know, maybe make them come back through the woods or back through the open ground and have their bucket ball a little bit uh, less damaging. So uh, I, I will give everybody props. This is something new. This is something different. I think me and Model will figure this out uh, a couple of days ago. Like, hey, we could actually go very far over to the north side of this map. What you know, let us pick out the terrain. And uh, it seemed okay. It is a little bit of a different terrain. It's typically, it's almost like hatchet attack, but for CSA. You know, they do have bucket ball, but it is, it is a little bit uphill for them. Yeah, there is a lot of really nice cover in here that you can kind of center yourself on. A lot of good rocks, a lot of good high positions. And it looks like, though, HL is going to start turning in along with night. Now, I think we'll see. That they might be able to turn this on them here. I think the Union got back at time. My only concern at the moment, I think the Union's a little bit too spread out here. I don't think yes. they can mutually support. And I think that was the intent of the plan. And if, if you can't mutually support, I think you're in trouble here right now. Yeah, it, I see a lot of CSA guys still alive. I, or, uh, New York went in, but we still have a couple elements over here. 19th and 79th, Lightburn, EB are still fighting these group of skirmishers. And now you got the second group coming in. Here comes first VA now getting into the fight. And again, that whole other section over here for the, for the CSA, Lightburn is starting to move out, but you still have EB and 79th all the way back there. Isolated. But they've held. They've held for now. You see 19th Indiana holding strong. There's Modal. Yeah, they, they still have the ground, but uh, ticket-wise aren't as bad as I thought it was going to be. It, this, this, is, this, is not, this is not bad. I mean, we're at 40 minutes. You don't want to go down at all, but it's so far, it's it's working. Head tilt, question mark? 
Yeah, this is. A, we still have the CSA. The HG is still over here on this left side, finding out that there is no union except coming from main spawn. Yep, and now EB has kind of tucked in a little bit more along with 79th. Like, this is much better positioning, I think, for them now. They've kind of formed a bit of a horseshoe. So now as a CSA, if you were like, okay, I, I know generally where the union was, how do you think, uh, how would you kind of approach this problem set now? What, what do you think they should be doing? Early cap. Early, it, it, early it, cap, force yeah, them out? Yeah, I would simply early cap, go all the way to the left, set up on this stone wall, and force them to come at you, because it's it's just like this other left side. If you, if you early cap, they have to come out of the woods. So I, I would early cap, understand that, okay, they're all consolidated over here, leaving you know yeah it's gonna be a little bit spread out but like hd right now they're they're not doing too much right now they're, they're standing over here waiting on this uh csa right side union left and there's no union over there except coming from main spawn no you're right and they're not really catching any of them to be honest with you i mean i, I see a couple dropping here and there but not really but yeah I, I would definitely swing onto the arty position realize that a we, we don't really have... Union doesn't really have already on this map anyways. Well, they are pulling back one gun, it looks like, here. MWB is pulling yeah. back a battery. Not to the they, normal they position. Have, They're going yeah, back. Yeah, this is this is... I think this is different for them. This is different for everybody. I don't think we've ever... I've ever seen somebody get the cannons all the way back, you know, on the road and maybe even in the very back far corner by uh, Cox's push. Yeah. Yeah, I see Motohard on top of the rock here in a very strong position. Um, I think you're right. I think early cap is the option. I think the, I mean, the Union is starting to lose some tickets here. Um, and maybe that's, I'm not sure of where that's coming from, if this guy's coming back from Maine, or if that's uh, from this firefight here. The ticket balance is starting to get a little bit, a uh, little bit, uh, yeah, half at 37 is not great. That bucking ball is going to chuck them up. I do like how there are solid but separate lines. Like EB has their own right now. New York under Frog has their own 19th. Hood. Like we are all, like, yeah, we're all together, but we all have our own separate line firing lines. Yeah, you're not losing co unit cohesion. You're still having that independence while being close or mutually supporting. And that is that is tough, and that is big. Oh, I just heard Nardi go off. Yeah, if you yeah, come, you come all the way back. Mattis is all the way back here, all the way back to you know. <laughs> I think it's pretty much as far as you can go. Oh yeah, they, and they're firing at HD in the Union left. Yep, and that's a pretty good Overwatch position for point. To be honest with you, we'll see if that makes a difference. But uh, the positioning is not bad. MWB is a little bit more forward, but they also have a better Overwatch on the point. My biggest concern, though, I, this, this ticket is, is going down quick. I'm going to try to figure out why and where that's happening. Because with this hard cover, I wouldn't think you'd be losing so many tickets. Correct. E e even if CSA has bucket ball, which I know they do. I don't, I don't, I don't remember which units they do, but I know they do have bucket ball. Oh, look at look at HG moving all the way around. Very spread out though. On the uh, running. Um, the yeah, that's I, I kind of like that. They might be able to catch the Artie. There's not really a union element to protect the Artie, which isn't a problem if the Artie runs away. The issue is where where is Artie going to run away to? Ah, uh, the friendly union. Yeah, they have not left in time. HD is going to catch these guys here from Mattis. Well, shit. Or they might be able to beat him. Uh, nope. 
It was it was close though. Are, are we? Are, are we? It's one man. I get. Yeah, it's one man spot. <laughs> or I guess two. I didn't see this other guy. I mean, they did a pretty good job defending themselves. Oh, 40 second uh, charged out HL on the rocks. It looks like. Oh, they did. Nice little charge. Didn't get caught. I wouldn't stay there, but. So I kill Roy and his little detachment. Flag northwest. Take aim, boys. Let's go to northwest, northwest. Directly northwest from here, if you can hear me. Now, do you think the Union needs to change anything right now, or do you think just kind of let this let this ride for a bit? Honestly, I'm. I would let it ride. I know the tickets aren't great right now, but you haven't given really position. CSA is firing uphill. That is like my only concern. And then obviously the ticket drain as well. It has slowed down maybe just a touch, but it's still a concern, especially for later, because we're only at 33 minutes, not even. Yeah, it's even especially on this map, if you're not 30 minutes and you're still and you're engaged, is is. Way. Looks like Knight and TB are shifting way far left, almost down the hill. Looks like they're trying to find the flank here. Looks like EB is kind of moving out to engage him. Get on the rocks, get on the rocks, there's some to the left as well. It's your reload. Yeah, that is uh, the danger, I think, on this position, is the CSA actually can maneuver pretty far back and can get behind. We'll see if uh, I'm going to fall night in, I think. I think you might be able to catch EB in the flank here. Direct alive! Oh no, EB saw him. Direct from! Take him direct from! Steady! 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 Alright, well, I'm going to fall in. That volley hurt him. Yeah. It's that bucket ball, man. Night Chief is coming to support. Yeah, I don't, I don't like this position. It for the EB, it is not, they're not really using any cover. Uh, Lightburn came up as well. Uh, Union's at engaged. It would not have 32 minutes yet. Uh oh! Did Hood get wiped? I see all of his, all the forty-second guys are back at. Me. I don't. Yeah, I was just looking for him. I, yeah, I guess he got wiped. I'm not sure where. I was watching the EB fight. I didn't. I didn't catch it. It's interesting because the smaller CSA units are way downhill. Well, it looks like, well, it looks like 19th Indiana and 4th West Virginia were able to come in time to uh, shore up the EB there. I, I don't know if it's honestly doing better than the left side. Because, I don't know, man. There's, oh, hold on. 40 seconds, charging out uh, HD, A couple of little elements of HD that kind of got spread out out here, yeah. West, southwest, cross the road. Look left. There you go. You got it. Yeah, I'm not sure if it's materially different. Um, what I like about it is you're not being forced back to your spawn and crowded out of being able to support um, a move on point. You still got options to counterattack point right now. As if you know, as opposed to if they get, you know, stuck up in main, it's it's almost impossible to attack out of that. They are going left to right, left uh, to right, <laughs> hard left to right. Hood's getting a little bit angry Double in uh, chat because people are friendly firing. Oh, is he? Uh, yeah. 
I guess a couple of the 19th guys friendly fired a little bit earlier, and then uh, he just said thanks, AWP artillery. So he uh, they, they did they did have it online, just uh, not the right fuse length. Yeah, you know. Yeah, I'm looking at MWB right now. I'm not a huge fan of where Willie Stone's got his guys. I think they're a little bit overexposed out here. I think I'm starting to see where these tickets train might be coming from. Uh, Fourth West Virginia, their skirmishers are a little bit further out than I think uh, eh. I, w I would prefer them. Uh, two U.S. Uh, is coming up behind. The, but it looks like 19 is moving to fight them. Stop, stop moving, stop moving, stop moving. But they know, they know, they know. Hold fire, hold fire. Oh, independent fire, boys. Cover, get yourself cover. Shift to the cover, shift to the cover, guys. Get behind the lug, get behind the lug. Pop up to shoot. Aim for groups with both of them. So, what do you think of this uh, engagement between 19th Indiana and 2 US right now? Still good, Still good to go. Oh, oh boy. I gotta, I gotta, oh boy. We're, we're independent firing. No, they're falling oh, back. No. They're falling back. Yeah. And they're and they're behind a tree. Model, it's five guys. Just let it be. They fell back. We hit it. Oh, he pulled out of there. Uh, right west, I think they're just. West. If if my 15, 20 man unit can't beat five guys, I don't know what I'm doing. I saw the blood splashes. Back to load. I saw the blood awesome. splashes. Yeah. Uh, now we're at 28 minutes. Uh, CSA just hit engage. Union is, let's say, maybe two thirds of the way left. Yeah, oh, like, TB is uh, charging in. Yeah. Yeah. 40 seconds. Honestly, I don't know if I would, I would have done that. I mean, if they if they were on the left side, not doing anything, not really engaging with anybody, I might have just left them. Yeah, I, I think I might have done the same. Is let sleeping dogs lie. Don't don't correct them. You know, let them keep doing their mistake. You know. You know, you yeah, kill them. They're like, oh well, now I'll be back at main. Oh, the fight's over here. Oh, let me redeploy over here. Yeah, because now that brought over first VA and PB, but it now looks like they're shifting yeah. back to the north. I will say, it looks like uh, EB and 19th Indiana and uh, 4th West Virginia and some others were able to defeat that TB charge um, pretty well. I'm not, I'm not hating this strategy. I just think, think I think it's too, a little bit too ill-disciplined. I'll be honest, if I could put it that way. I got, I got to give it to Second US right now. Nobody has any idea that five CSA guys are behind. Well, oh, they, 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 they so should. Hard. It's 19th Indiana that left them, didn't he? Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, good, very good use of cover. Run away. I'm uh, gonna get the little shot and get out of there. Get the flag You gotta run into the arty. We got three. We got three. Uh, three. Uh, yeah. Easy oh, tickets. Skin. Two, yeah, three. that's 15 tickets. I take it. Yep. I lost maybe two guys, probably six, maybe uh, maybe nine. Again, those those usually aren't worth it though. At the end, it's good. You know, it's, it's more forgivable as the attacker to do stuff like that. Looks like Knight's going to try again on this uh, left side. Uh, I think this he's losing a lot of men. He's facing a lot of guys. See who he's facing. He's, he's still maneuvering. He's got first VA, PB, Fort Georgia here. Good shots on these rafts. Good shots on the rafts. So, there's like a thousand officers in front of me. Um, 
We had too much work to do to have to mow all the mages. So the CSA hasn't capped, though, which I find interesting. Yeah, they, I feel like, uh, oh, and as we start speaking about it, it goes down just a little bit, but I believe that might be naturally paired. I mean, two U.S. is on it right now. Oh, they, they are indeed on it. I mean, if it's just passing through, it shouldn't be a problem. Or, you know, they could cap it. I mean, I, I wouldn't right now. That was, you know, it's... I don't know, would you cap right now? I, I'd be a little bit hesitant. Um, I, would, I would definitely be hesitant. I mean, I think right now you're at a good ticket rate. Yeah, it's going to be a little bit closer than what you probably would have liked. You know, it looks like some, somebody's charging up here, CSA-wise. HL is going against uh, New York. Oh, and that's a, that's a wipe. Yep. Uh, here comes Hazard. You know, I'd say a little bit too uh, disaggregated, a little bit too, uh, you need to get the mutual support when the friendlies are still alive. Yeah, but now now just I'm just waiting for Knight back here in TB to charge your way with Bucket Ball. Yep. Because now, now we're too spread out. You got Knight threatening this back here. Yeah, it's it's um it's a very spread out formation now. It was tight earlier, now it's all kinda I think they ran away. They definitely did. MWB and full, back and full strength moving uh back on the rocks that they were originally on the west. Yeah. I, I think they should be a little bit more closer to the, uh, the friendlies if I... Yeah, I don't think they're really in a supporting position, to be honest with you. And it's very... I mean, yeah, I'm sure you're getting great shots, but, you know, if somebody needs you, you're not going to get there in time. Looks like Hood has went back to the Union left. And he's holding, uh, looks like HD, PB, some others back here as well. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I mean yeah. that's that's three units. It is, but it's about equal to his unit, yeah. so I'd, I'd say it's a, it's a wash. Uh, we got EB now fighting against TB. See, here's the problem I have right now for this Union defense team. You should not be fighting these guys evenly. Should be massing up. Okay, here comes 19th Indiana. Like, okay, this is a little bit better. Find a unit, eat it, move on to the next unit. Yeah. Hey, that, was a good that was a nice little volley there by 19th. And again, I kind of like the positioning. They kind of came in at a nice angle, flanked fire, intersecting lines. It's all, it's all about the angles, even if it's you know just like 10 yards. It's a different way of firing into the fire Yep. No, absolutely. You... That was fucking crazy. Now the, I will say the union's starting to catch up on tickets a little bit here. Maybe not, maybe it's just uh maybe my eyes are deceiving me on it. I don't know, I, I still think it's pretty close to about where it was a couple minutes ago, but it looks like Fort uh, Georgia may be capping. Uh, let's take a look. Uh, yeah, Fort Georgia's on it, yeah. Indian on taking losses. That's my... This so That's not ideal. It's not ideal, but at least it's different, and you're not being forced to sit in spawn. So it, 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 it's no I, worse I than the other strategy. All together, uh, yeah, I think I, we're all together and consolidated as like, like we were a little bit earlier. Like, yeah, we were all next to each other, but it was four separate, distinct lines, and we were all in cohesion. Yeah, I. And it goes to cap. Um, yeah, yeah, I think it's, I, I think you're right, it's, it, 
And then, um, what was I going to say? It's no worse than the other strategy. I'll say it like that. <laughs> it's like, oh, well, this didn't work. I was like, it, it's, 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 it's not working at very least the same rate that the other plan wasn't working, you know? <laughs> so at the very least, you know, hey, you got two options. Yep. And like you said, this now, one, this does... one could be executed a little bit better too, so. Yeah. Question is now, how does Union recap? If I was the Union right now, I would, I would, everybody that's in the woods, leave the woods right now, flood towards point. Because I mean, 20 you, minutes at engaged is honestly pretty good. Well, that's the thing. Like, all these guys that have spread out chasing guys in the woods right now, stop doing what you're doing. You're between them and the point. You will beat them to the point. But they're all out here kind of, you know, chasing chasing tail over here. Oh, and it's New York and 19th. Are we, are we trying to chase down TV? Yeah, I mean, what does this get you right now? It's, it's You're just going to lose. Oh, you're doing even if you kill them? What does that get you? Because now you have less that you're going to get back on ticket game. Yeah. There's no point in doing this attack right now whatsoever. This is a boneheaded move, in my opinion. It's a, not to be too mean on them, but this... And now, now look how far you are, you know, you dragged yourself all the way over there, you wiped them out, they're going to respawn, and now it's a race to the point. Yep. And now the the woods is pretty much clearly undefended. We have EB, you know, it looks like EB and 4th West Virginia are shifted Back to the right. south. Back to the left. So I, I which, guess which we're actually is, the right side? Uh, well, again, I would, I, would, I would say you need to retake the point as quick as possible right now as Union. Yep, yep. Yeah, boys, come for spawn. So I, I, I'd almost be alright abandoning the right, but I don't know why they're going that far. Because you could cap the point from a little bit into the woods, into yeah. the, the uh, north side there. You don't need to go forward in this attack. I don't know why they're... Again, you don't need to attack. You need to recap. You don't need to kill the... Killing the enemy actually hurts you right now. <laughs> Yeah, this, I, is, this is interesting because Hood, Hood is behind the log pile while EB and 4th West Virginia are starting to shoot up HD right behind them. Yeah, but it, it, EB's going to this charge. He's just going to get eaten. Oh, jeez. This is just... Yeah, yeah I would have just, just shot him at that point. I mean, Hood's trying to recap point here, but the problem is he's going to have no support. And eight, this this big mass here, HDHL, is just going to turn and eat them. NYV, form on my left. Form on my left here. NYV, forming sure on, my left here. on my left here. They are recapping. On my left here, so we'll cover. But now instead of at the G of engaged, you're barely at engaged. Yeah, it's a, all that more you could have gotten. Which is not a lot, but, you know, take take what you can get, man. NYV, over here. NYV, Why give it away? And, you know, you got the Union staying off point, shooting, versus going in and helping, and the Union on points getting eaten. See that element in the woods there, this NYV element, and... Oh, this, 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 uh, little... Oh, they're about to get eaten, too. Look at this. Yeah, it, it, it is on point, but now they put themselves in a very bad position. Yeah, look at Knight, look at Knight's about to do to him. Coming back from Maine after you killed him. Yeah, that, that's going to be a complete team wipe. This, this is I, I, this is it for me. I think this is... I don't think this is recoverable. Nope. So now the Union's going to have no flags. They're all going to be at main, and CSA only has to hold for three minutes. Which gives you enough time for one attack? Maybe. Maybe, yeah. And the CSA's They're got plenty of time to get in position, get their loads and just wait for you to come down this road. Even though that element over there survived, you know, this, this, whoever these guys are, looks like some 19th Indiana, some MWB, some NYV, it, it doesn't matter. It's, you know, you're not gonna be there to help point. And here comes the final charge by Mr. Hood. Yeah, all, all Union, 
much trickling in right now. Now they are capping right now, but we'll see this counterattack from HD. Talking about the flags, flags don't matter anymore. I hate to say yeah. it. Come here, Hood. Come here, Hood. Yeah. That's not Hood, Wilkes, that's Kilroy. <laughs> well, I've got the time because really I'm just going to watch this charge come in. Um, where can guys yeah. find you in uh, the 19th Indiana? Uh, to join our Discord, I mean, we, we post links pretty much everywhere. There's uh, a link in the description to the 19th Indiana as well, yeah, guys. There, yeah, there's a, there's a link in your description. Uh, we do have War Rights Company, too. We do have one up. How long is going to be up until they take it away? No idea. We're Company B. Company A is no longer active. Uh, we do post on Reddit from time to time. And then, of course, in the War of Red Side General. I do need to get into the Steam group and uh, like the forums and stuff. I haven't been able to figure out that, but I've also been busy and obviously uh, stick. <laughs> yeah, yeah, obviously. Well, that'll do it. Yep, that's the end of that. Uh, any final thoughts? I think uh, Union should have played tighter. Especially on the uh, right side, because it kind of the, the CSA didn't really know what to do um, with the Union holding on the right. I mean, HD was over on the left side 98% of the time, not engaged. So, I mean, you're missing 30, 30 guys over there. Um, so I, I think it could have worked a little bit better if everybody's was tighter. Yeah, I think so. And again, it, 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 the other big piece with that is I, I think they misplayed once the CSA capped and didn't prioritize that enough. I think that was the other big mistake. But um, I will say for the CSA, I think they reacted fairly well towards it. You know, it took them a little bit, but uh, between TB and 2US and some of those other units, those are some good attacks I saw. Yep. The adaptability from the CSA right now is pretty on spot. Yep. Not ready to, uh, I think this still might work, the uh, the new plan, so uh, I'll say uh, at least no worse than the other one. Anyway, guys, um, thanks uh, first to Mr. Joker. Always good to have him. Thank you for having me on. And then I will see you guys uh, for the next one, I think for uh, HTC tomorrow.